I, there is nothing worse than eating a salad. You go to a restaurant and somebody hasn't dried the lettuce and the dressing is runny. I, I, oh, that is like the, one of the biggest pet peeves of mine. And one day, and I was, you know, was, when we were younger, these things weren't around. I met somebody that actually had a salad spinner. I'm like, that's the smartest thing I've ever seen. You spin your salad, gets rid of all the moisture, so the dressing fits in there, right? You used to have the one that had a pull, a pull string, or you had one that you had to pump. This is brand new, and I can't wait to get off air to buy this. This is from Kitchen HQ, again, our proprietary brand. This is a uh, basically a USB charged, right? So it's, it's cordless, has a, has a battery built in, a salad spinner, no effort. You hit a button and you can spin your salad or you can spin whatever it is you want to dry. Any kind of produce, you know, it could be broccoli, things like that that you want to get the moisture out of after you cook it. Anything that you want to dry off, you can stick inside here. It is unbelievable. It is 839-808. Look at the price. It's $18.95. It's even on FlexPay. I think the FlexPay is like three bucks and change. $379. John is back. I think this is brilliant. <laughs> it is. I've never seen one before. It's a USB charged salad spinner. Uh, uh, there's no cords, okay? The old salad spinners where you had to sit there, yeah. it was like starting a lawnmower. Or the pump right? one. Or they had to, used to have a pump one. Now, look at this. All you do is push one button. <laughs> it starts up, spins the salad. You can literally Coming see. Coming close. How, how the, all of the moisture on that salad is spun to the outside, it flings it to the, to the bowl, it drops down all the dirt, all, this, all the, you know, everybody knows you have to wash lettuce, right? Oh, God. When, when you're doing things like lettuce or your berries or things like that. Do you that, even trust the one that says it's pre-washed? No. <laughs> no. When I you open some, up that bag. I see some guy with his hands. Yeah, you don't know what's in there. Digging right? in there, right, and right, right. Plus all of the, uh, the th different things that the grocery stores put on your sure. food to make it last longer, all that stuff. You want to get all that off. I love this, okay? I've wow. had salad spinners in the past that when it starts up, all the salad goes over the top and out to yeah, the yeah, side, yeah. and you end up with stuff in the bottom. Take a look at this. We just spun out this salad completely dry. I mean, look at this. It's, like, completely oh, dry. It's beautiful. And the water at the bottom, and here's what I want you to see. The most, this, this came out of a bag, okay, pre-bagged from the grocery store, but look at this. Can you see the color in that? That's dirty, dirty water, okay? It's almost like tea, it's yeah. so dirty, right? Yeah. But that's what comes off of your lettuce, just lettuce alone. Imagine now, Guy, your berries, uh, but, uh, you know, uh, vet, different vegetables that you yeah. may want to wash, everything you should wash. Things like mushrooms, okay? Instead of just taking them out of the package, slicing them up and putting them on your salad, or throwing them in a frying pan and sauteing them sure. for a steak, place the lid over the top. And again, this keeps even the smaller things inside the salad spinner. You're gonna place place the, like the which one is which? Here, here we're gonna, yeah. we're gonna use the white one this That's time. Okay. Place it over the top. All you do is push this button. Now, what? right here on the top, there's four little little holes. Those are the lights that tell you the charge, okay? You can see the charging port here. Yep. It comes with its own cord, so you plug it into any USB port. It'll charge up. Once it's charged up, it spins and spins and spins and spins. And we're that it's 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 like a washing awesome. machine. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like your clothes washer oh spins your clothes dry. And That's I love what this is doing to your fruits, vegetables. I love the size of it. Yeah, because and you can most see those salad four. spinners are huge. Yeah. Oh, and, yeah. And most people just need they enough take for two up or three too salads. too much space yes. in your kitchen. Totally. And listen, hey, real estate in the kitchen is at a premium, and especially in my house. Because we, listen, we, we, uh, your kitchen cabinets, if you've got one of those giant salad spinners, imagine now, take a look at this. Mushrooms. Mushrooms, completely dry. I'm going to put these over the top of the salad. And by here. the way, Look at that! Not an ounce, not a drop you of moisture. You should always left wash. I know they tell you not to wash your mushrooms. It's like dry them off with a towel. They still have dirt all over them. Yeah. If the, the key is you want to remove the moisture, so most people don't even do that. Look at the gunk. Yeah, the dirt that came off those mushrooms. And you know, mushrooms grow out of the ground. They're gonna yeah. have dirt in them, so you want yeah. to wash them and rinse them. And that's the nice part about this. You add it to the bowl. Okay, so you're gonna add whatever vegetables. If it's mushrooms, if it's salad, uh, throw them in the bowl. Take them to your sink. Rinse them off and now instead of having those dirty mushrooms the water works it through you place the lid over the top place it back in here Watch and look this. at this all you do is push a button Watch. and it starts that spinning <laughs> action you can literally see any moisture come off on the side of the bowl it all all that dirt all that the, the chemicals that some you know certain things hey did you know that shrimp 
The, the, when you buy shrimp in the grocery stores, yeah. you know, when they come off the boat, even fresh seafood, they have a, a thing that they spray onto, onto shrimp to keep it from smelling. Yeah, because okay? it, it, it goes bad so quickly. Right, and right. with shrimp especially, peeled or unpeeled shrimp, you really, really want to rinse and spin your shrimp, okay? It's very important because you want to get that off of there, that chemical that they put on there, and watch this. All you do is push the button. And there's like probably a pound of shrimp, pound and a half of shrimp yeah. in here <laughs> to give you an idea. But look at the moisture that, awesome. that comes out of that, okay? Now, not only does it make it easier to peel your shrimp, but your, your sauces, your anything that you, if you want, you know, add it to it, right? Uh, cooked shrimp too. Well, try you to get to... try to get batter to stick to a wet shrimp. Right. It doesn't happen. Yeah, you always right. try. Now you I always batter. pat dry pat Absolutely. dry the shrimp before I. Uh, now you flour don't them. have to pat it dry. Look All that. of that moisture is spun out and of the shrimp. Way, look what's in the bowl. And, yeah, and you can see how that suds up like that. That's disgusting. <laughs> hey, everybody, give me a cup. Let's add that to this. <laughs> look it's, at the dirt. Everything that comes off of there, you can see the dirt. You can stuff. see the chemicals. You can see all of that stuff. And look at that. I mean, that's what would be on your food if you didn't spin it like this. Yeah. Rinse and spin. Rinse and spin. All right. If you can use express ordering, we are under 20 bucks. This is just flying off the shelves, and I knew it would. I'm going to buy one after work. You know what? I, I'm looking at your next demo, and I do this all the time. Yep. Is I buy, I love, like, strawberries and blueberries are, like, two of my favorite fruits. You know, they're, they're low in sugar, but they're delicious, right? You love them? Um, and they're only in season for a while. You don't want to waste your money. What I do with mine is I leave them in the package, right? You know, the plastic packaging that it comes in, the clamshell? Right. And I actually put apple cider vinegar yep. on it. Yep. And then I rinse it in water because it makes them last longer. Sure. It also helps with the flavor because the vinegar is kind of tart, and then you have the, you have the strawberry and it's sweet. <laughs> but I always wash them. Yes. I never, you should never eat fruit without washing it. This would be perfect for that, John. Well, and that's the thing. So what you're going to do, you're going to throw your berries, whatever it is, inside the spinner basket. Take it to your sink. You're going to rinse off your berries, yeah. run it right under that cold water tap. Yeah. And then you're going to take that bowl or that spinner basket right to the bowl, place it down inside, put the lid on the top so even those little blueberries aren't going to end up on the outside. And then you place the lid on top, push that button, and guy, look at this. Watch the water. Just take a look at the water, the, the liquid that comes off of those, spun to the outside, all the dirt, all of the, the, the things that they spray on your vegetables at the grocery store yeah. to help them last, make them last longer, all of that is rinsed off and spun off. And look what's left in the bottom of this bowl. Now, this, this is a lot of, of berries in here, okay? But watch this. I'm going to take the lid off, and we're going to pour this out back into our... Look at this. This is just four things that we've done. The berries, by the way... If you feel yeah, that, I, well, I'm looking inside. Yeah, look, they're clean. Look they're at the, fresh. And, they're, and they're there's dry. no dirt, and they're dry. Okay, but look what came off of there, guy. <laughs> Take a look at this. Yeah. I'm going to pour this in here. More fruit. Look tea. at the dirty water. That I mean, that was what was on there. So you really want to make sure that you rinse and spin dry yeah. all of your produce, all of your berries, your especially lettuce, things that grow, anything that grows out of the ground. Salad spin it. <laughs> hey, how many of you have read? Look at that water. Or heard about? I, mean, I wouldn't like drink that. somebody got sick because of, of some bad lettuce right? or whatever. It's always a good idea to wash it. Like I said, if you're doing fruits, try the trick I told you about the um, the um, apple cider vinegar. I'm yep. telling you, it's great. And and everything. I mean, from your meats, right, that you want to rinse off, from your salads, from your produce, all that stuff. And all you do is hit a button. I love this for our senior friends out there who probably don't want to have to pull a cord. Yep. All you and do those is push always, They always seem to break. Yes, yeah. thanks. Yeah. This is simple. You have a battery built into the lid. All you do is take your cord, plug it in, charge it up. It's got a little, uh, little battery gauge on it. You'll see when you see four lights, you're fully charged. And then all you do is walk over and hit the button. Yep. That's it. <laughs> I, I am hands free. Right. Right? I mean, that is it. And then when you're done, you turn the button off, lift it up. I mean, this is, John, this is brilliant. Look at this. And again, Why it spins it at such a high rate of speed, but it doesn't spin it. It's not going to harm your food. It's not no. going to, like, squish your food. Everything in there, the, and the longer you let it spin, the drier your lettuce is going to get, okay? And again, you mentioned it. I've, I've done it. I've, I've seen it and, and done it at home even where you get lazy, right? So it, I, if you've ever had salad dressing, I'm a big blue cheese guy. 
I like ranch as well. Dude, I can drink but it out you of know the bottle. When you, when you pour <laughs> blue cheese dressing over a wet salad, That's it awesome. just turns into like mush. I can, when <laughs> it you doesn't go to, even stick to the I leaves. would not go back to a restaurant that yeah. didn't dry their... Produce. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because that that you're, like you said, that's the first thing you get. And what's and the like, only other way to do it is yeah. to pat it dry with paper towels, that's... and you're wasting paper towels, and it takes all kinds I've, of time. I've done that. Before. Now you have yeah, <laughs> now you have before. a spinner, and yeah. you can see how it spins the lettuce all to the outside, so it's completely dry. So when you pour this out onto your into your bowl, you've got dry lettuce ready to go, and it's clean, it's fresh, it's yeah. ready to go, and all of that dirty water ends up in the bottom of the bowl. Remember, we already did this once okay so and look at the difference in the color of the water we just did it a second time but look at the difference it's clean now yeah, yeah. so even you know if you don't have to do it two times but let me tell you it's it's important to spin out the water from your salad all right well it's already uh, it's, it's getting close salad. to being half sold out so if you want to get if you want to get one of these or two of these, I'm telling you, it'd be a great housewarming gift for oh, somebody. Yeah. Maybe your kids moved into an apartment. I mean, and, and honestly, look at the size of it. It's the perfect size. I've got I've got one that works sometimes and then doesn't work other times. Right. That I have. It's twice this size. It's me and Danny. I don't need to make. I don't need to, to do yeah, like right. salad for, for twelve me, it's, people. It's just my wife and I now. All the yeah. kids have moved out of the house. It's perfect this is for the two to perfect four size yeah. for a, 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 a two-person salad. The perfect size. But even things like 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 we talked about earlier, the shrimp, the berries, anything that you, all the, the fresh things that we bring home from the grocery store. Now we can rinse, spin. It's rinse and spin. Remember, uh, and, and there's no repeat. That's the thing. It right. rinse it all down right. first. It's kind of like, you know, when you're washing your hair, you know, yeah. with lather, rinse, repeat. On well, this, there's no repeat. This all is... you do is rinse it, spin it, and, and you've got button. completely dry. And all you do is push the button. And again, the little charging port right here in the front, you plug in the USB charging cord that comes with it yeah. into any, any uh, block that you have in the wall. Uh, and I'll tell you, uh, it's so quick and easy. And again, this is all the room it takes up in your kitchen. It's yeah. not those, you know, most salad spinners that I've seen are like this big. Take up oh, all huge. kinds of yeah. real estate in the kitchen. Yeah. Now you never have to worry about that. I'm going to pour these mushrooms over the top of the salad so you guys can see. They're completely dry. 900, completely dry. 900 or so left. We started and with 2,000. So that's how fast they're going. You can see we just went over 1,000 sold, and Kyle, our producer, just flipped. We're down to the left counter right now. I know our clock ran down. We're going to go a little bit longer. because <coughs> I'll be honest with you. I've worked with John for many, many years. Yeah. It takes a lot to really, like, wow, wow me now in right. food. <laughs> that is a wow. Yeah, like, it is. To, to just touch a button with your finger yeah. and then and rinse your lettuce, and now it's done. And, and, and Here's again, what I'm gonna do. you know exactly what I'm talking about, especially Facebook friends. Hi, love you guys. You know how they're always, they make the salad spinner so big. Yeah. Mine actually has to go under the cabinet. Right. Like I can't even leave right. it out. It's huge. I'm going to pour some and more water over school. these berries. I got to spin it from the top. I mean, watch this. Now, here's your yeah. berries. I just uh, rinsed off the berries. I'm going to put it down inside. The, the, the colander fits right inside the basket. The lid, this is what's great about this. It has that lid, so it keeps all of your produce, all of your lettuce, ev everything inside the spinner, so you won't get it down inside the bowl. The, place the lid over the top, one push of the button, and look at all the water spin off into that bowl. And that dirty, now you're removing all the dirt and you're drying your berries at the same time, and all you're doing is pushing a button guy. Yeah. The longer you let it spin, the drier it's well, gonna get. And John, you know in the old school ones, mm -hmm. there's about three different ways that can break. Right. The handle can break. Right. The cord can <laughs> right. break. Right, the cord, yeah. The pump can break that you push up <laughs> and down. I had a lawnmower that did that once. Oh, yeah, yeah. You pull the cord and the lawnmower, the string breaks. It comes and right you, out. Yeah. <laughs> this, it's just touching a button. Yeah. You have a battery and built in, so it's a USB rechargeable, which means if you want to take this with you camping. Right. Go ahead. Oh, yeah. Charge it up before you charge go. Charge it up before you go. You know, you right. want to take it to, a, to, to an if event. If you're going out picking mushrooms sure. or, you know, if you're out yeah. picking berries, uh, you know, you can <laughs> go to the creek, That's, rinse off your berries, hey. throw them in here, push the button. That's you could do that right at Creekside. If I see that at a campsite, <laughs> yeah. I'm impressed. And I'm look. like, that's pretty dang cool for a camper. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, for an RV, it's yeah, great. Yeah. For, a camp, like you say, camping. Or just to keep in the kitchen. And again, it's like half the size of those giant salad spinners that, uh, that everybody has a hard time with. Now you can do this, and it takes up way less space in the kitchen. And it's by Kitchen HQ, our proprietary brand. Right we there. take your ideas, our customers, and create these products from your ideas and bring them to you. Look at a ridiculous.
ridiculously low price. Look how many are left. Yeah. All right, you can see it's just jumping <laughs> seven at a time. Wow. So if you want to get this, you should be online right now. Get on your phone. I would call, I would get this thing. You're gonna love it. My only fear. Every time I you really, really want you something, can spin on the go. Right? You can't look. He's walking and spinning. I, I know you better get to the phone. It's probably going to sell out. So uh, maybe somebody's in the green room. I'm in a one out of luck again. I got to wait until he comes back. Maybe